What is going on guys, Tidwafi here, and welcome back to some more Stardew Valley. Now, last time left off, you guys might have seen I have a new sword. We got this new sword last episode. We went over to the Adventurer's Guild. Where is that at? Uh, all the way up here, Adventurer's Guild. Went over there and actually bought ourselves a new sword. I think this cost like $1,000 or something like that. Actually, I think it was like $500, was not it? Uh, wasn't really too expensive. We got rid of our old rusty sword and get ourselves a, what is this, a wooden sword? Yeah, a wooden sword, level one sword. Not bad for a piece of carved wood. Three to seven damage. I did get a comment from, some, from someone saying that if I did open my inventory, uh, how do I do that? There you go. I could have at least, uh, I could have actually seen what the damage of the, the rusty sword was. So pff, I don't know if it actually was better than this or not, but uh, hopefully this is better. <laughs> Either way, last episode, we also uh, went fishing. Uh, we had a mission to actually find two small, uh, actually catch two smallmouth bass and actually got that mission done. We got 100 gold from that, which isn't really too bad, but we also got another mission over here to slay monsters. These things are actually like timed. You can see it says it's its final day to kill eight green slime. So I definitely want to do this and we get 480 gold, which is a decent amount. So it's definitely worth it to, to do that mission. So we're going to be doing that pretty heck quickly, especially because it's only 7 a.m. right now. So don't want to don't want to waste our energy on other stuff and not have any energy for the uh, the slime murdering and whatnot. But uh, also another thing that happened last episode, we got the foraging bundle for the spring for uh, for the community center. I think it was also the what was it called? The, the, the craft craft room crafting room. What is what was it called? You remember what that was called? Pantry there. Crafts room. That's what it's called. So we got this one open and it gave us like a mystery box at the very bottom. They gave us like 30 different uh, like spring season seeds, which is really, really good. So that's what we have planted over here. That's what our uh, little, little, little growth things going on over here. So hopefully we actually get a pretty good amount of stuff, because if I want to continue doing more community center stuff, we actually need to. Uh, is it pantry? Yeah, we need to get a parsnip green bean. We already have the cauliflower I already donated that last episode. And then we know we also need to get a potato and then we'll have the spring crops bundle done for the pantry. And the reward is, uh, I guess we get a, a straight up greenhouse or hold on. Let me let me continue watering this. You guys remember that shack that's to my left over there? I wonder if that used to be a greenhouse, but it like got all collapsed and dilapidated and, and rotted away and whatnot. I wonder if that is going to like get repaired if we end up doing this uh, pantry mission for the crops and whatnot. I wouldn't be surprised if that's the case. Uh, but either way, let me let me continue uh, watering all my crops over here. I'm almost out of water, too. <laughs> let me continue watering all the crops over here, and we'll head on over to that mine, kill, I think, what was it, eight slimes? And then hopefully get almost 500 buckaroos from that. So let me continue watering these crops, and I'll see you guys here in just a bit. I right, guess I am done watering the crops there. So uh, let's see. Let's look at our inventory real quick. Uh, yeah, you know what? Let's go put up some things. I do know we could use this stuff for bait. What was this called? We also got this from, uh, I think we got this from fishing. And we caught like a chest, which is really good. Oh wait, no, this is straight up bait. Ooh, you know, I kind of want to test that out though. Yeah, let's, let's keep that. And we also have iron ore. I think we need three more of that iron ore until, in order to make something. We need uh, an iron ingot. And then of course we could actually do something with that. Uh, I forgot what it was, but uh, we'll, we'll, I'll probably remember that <laughs> a little bit later on once we actually have the iron ore. What I'm excited for though is, oh man, we're actually somewhat low on energy. Well, how much energy does this give us? 13 energy, which, uh, in the grand scheme of things, isn't really that much. What about the salmon berries? That's uh, 25. Holy heck, salmon berries are good. Really good for energy. How do I uh, eat? Yep, eat salmon berry. Boom. A little bit of energy right there. So uh, I need to eat about three more of those, and I'll be full on energy, which is going to be great because we need as much energy as possible for the uh, the slime murdering that we're going to be doing. Let's eat one more, and we'll be full. So, uh, nip. yeah, we get so many heckin' salmon berries. It's really, really good. I don't, I don't care. Oh, wait, why do we get... Oh, I think, yeah, okay, I was about to say, like, why did I get 25 energy from the other salmon berries and only 20 energy from that one? But yeah, I guess that's kind of topped us off. We're already at full uh, energy at that point. And yeah, look at how common salmon berries are. Like, once you notice that these are actually salmon berries and or, uh, salmon berry bushes and you can actually get salmon berries from them, you see them all over the place, which is great. I got some comments of you guys actually saying that uh, I can get, what was it, like blackberries or something like that in other seasons, or maybe they're different uh, plants that give us the blackberries, but... Yeah, I would not be uh, surprised if we continue getting like really, really abundant like plants from just nature, I guess you can call it. Because uh, these salmon berries are really, really good. Even though they, I'm like, they give you a little bit of health. I forget how much health you actually have. That only pops up whenever you're actually uh, damaged. So, gonna have to wait for that. There's more salmon berry there, more salmon berry there. Yeah, you can see we have an absolute ton. And uh, thankfully it doesn't expel energy to, uh, to pick the salmon berries. But remember, last time we were in the mines, we actually went down and unlocked layer 10. So uh, let's go down here, and this is going to be a great opportunity for us to test out our brand new sword. Oh man, uh, I forgot to check what my luck was today. So I don't know how lucky, oh whoa, this area is infested, ooh. Well I can already see there's like jungle, like 
trees or whatever you want to call it. They're like overgrowth. Hold on. We got the slime pinned up against the wall. Just keep spamming. This is what you guys told me to do. Whenever we see a uh, boom. We, oh, wait. No, it jumped over me. I thought we got it killed right there. Okay, there we go. We got it killed there. Got a little bit of slime. We got a slime right there. So that's good. Basically trash. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. With Diglett. Oh, yeah. I forgot that this like quicksand looking stuff. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Doing damage. Did we kill it? No, no, no. I think, I think I killed it there. Did I get anything? I don't think I got anything. Well, it's not chasing after me anymore, so I guess I killed it. Hmm. Oh, whoa, 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 what is that? That thing is moving so fast. I'm going to keep spamming here, though. Oh, man, there's another one there. Bug meat. We just got some bug meat. That's good. We could use that for bait, because we already have 10 bait we got from that random chat. Here we go, here we go. Oh, now if we want to make more, we could easily do that, right? Oh, where well, there's a cro uh, rock crab right there. Definitely want to try and kill that thing, and hopefully it drops an actual crab. Remember last time we killed a rock crab and it dropped a crab? We could use that for uh, one of the community center things, you guys. So hopefully this guy actually drops the crab itself instead of like rocks or something like that, right? Oh, uh, I guess that's even better. <laughs> it unlocked the way down there, so that's good. These are one shots, right? Yep, one shot kill for those little flying mosquito guys there. We can kill the slime, hopefully. Oh, oh, here you go. I don't know if I can pin it against the walls here. I'm just going to keep. Oh, there you go. I'm just going to keep spamming it there. Uh, oh man, our. Oh yeah, our energy. Wait. Wow, we only lost two energy during all that? That's actually kind of surprising. Thought I'd lose way more considering how much I've been spamming the heckin' sword there. Even though I know it only uses energy. Apparently, only whenever you actually hit an enemy, so... I don't know why it's, uh... Wouldn't do anything there. But it does make sense to actually break these over here. I think I'm gonna break... Just these... Like, the gray stone-looking ones. I, I feel like they might have iron. And then I'll break the orange one, like that one right there. These are the... I'm gonna ignore the, like, the... Like that, I guess, reddish tannish. Oh, whoa, we already found the way down right there. And uh, I'll ignore like the brown ones as well, just because I'm pretty sure, just from what I read in the comments, uh, I'm pretty sure those are basically a waste of time. So I don't want to don't want to deal with those. But we do have a slime here. Oh, there you go. Oh, man, there's a, uh, a second way down there. Ooh, and there's a minecart here, too. We can actually ride. What if we can actually ride it, though? Oh, this guy's going to. Oh, man, I have to try and orient myself, make sure I can actually. There you go. Got him. Now, I wonder if these both head down to the same area, or maybe this one heads down to a different area. Kind of curious about it. And can we use this minecart? Or, uh... Oh, whoa, 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 whoa! Oh, man, that had coal inside of it. Hold on. Okay, it looks like I'm safe. Uh, I think that I was, like, filling it with a like, heckin' smoke or something like that. Like, toxic fumes or something. <laughs> Glad that I'm out there, golly. There, copper ore right there, that's good. Uh, more potential copper over here. Uh, I don't know if I want to break that one. But, uh, here you go, break that. And then there's going to be little Diglett guys in here, right? I'm just kind of prepared for it. I'm just going to keep spinning. Yep, there's a Diglett, like, right underneath me. I was attacking it right there. And I think I killed it. There's that little hole where it was, uh, un undigletting itself out of the ground. I don't know. <laughs> How would you describe that? I don't know. But uh, I guess we killed it right there, which is good. Uh, our health is actually kind of low, you know? I I, I didn't even notice that. Let's eat some of these salmon bear. We're only getting 11 health from that. Uh, only five from the heckin' spring onions. Golly, that's nothing. I'll keep eating these, though. Just because, uh, oh man, we only have 100 health. That's actually decent, considering we got almost, uh, actually, we get 11% of our health. I was about to say almost 10%, but uh, it's literally 11% of our health, because we only have 100 health. But I'll keep eating these salmon berries. I'm full on energy. Uh, about three quarters on health right now, which is fine. Let's open up this barrel using the sword so we don't use energy. There you go. And so far, by the way, so far, I haven't found any iron from these right here. I wonder if iron is in a different looking rock, or maybe I have to find. Oh, whoa, 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 what's that? What's that? Oh, an earth crystal. Ooh. We probably have to find iron from something that looks like this, but instead of the orange little speckles, it's probably like gray or something, you know? I wouldn't be surprised if that's in uh Oh, oh, whoa, oh, whoa, 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 look at this bug! Man, that's a fast bug. I, I wonder if you spend too much time in one uh, layer, if it starts filling up with that toxic fog. That's probably what happens. Hold on, let's kill all these enemies here. Did we find the way down yet? I don't think we... Oh, we have a diglet right underneath us. Come on, I'm just going to keep spamming here. There's one, like, right underneath me. Oh, there you go. I killed the uh, diglet right there, which is good. We got cherry bomb from the heckin' diglet. That is crazy. I think that's how we got the first uh, cherry bomb. Probably from killing one of those diglet guys. But uh, let's see what's inside of this big ol' rock right here. I'll make an exception. I know I said... Oh my gosh, we got a lot of stone. I know I said I wouldn't break those rocks, but because it was a huge one, I, I just kind of had to, you know? <laughs> But I, yeah, like I said, I don't know if we actually found our way down. I don't think we have. Might be in the center here, actually. Hold on, are these orange, I think. Nah, I don't know. There's a bug right there. I, I bet if I kill this bug, a heckin' ladder's gonna appear under it, right? Uh, no. Oh, 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 we got another bug. Ah, spam it, spam it, spam it. 
Taking some damage. We're at about uh, just under half health. We do need to watch out for that. Ooh, there you go. Another one behind me. There you go. Come on. Do damage. Do da oh, my gosh. Oh, that one down. That's good. Come on. Kill this dumb bug. Look at how fast it's moving. So sporadic all over the place. Golly. And there's a diglet under me, too. Oh, no. I can't. I can't get out of here. I'm going to start dying. Kill the dumb bug. There you go. Okay. Eat the salmon berry. Eat it. Eat it. Eat it. Pretty sure we're going to start heckin' dying here from whatever this toxic sludge fog mist is. I don't know. Ah, man. Just break random rocks. Find the way down. Ah, we're taking damage. I'm pretty sure we're going to start taking, like, toxic. Man, there's so many of these bugs. I'm getting overrun. Ah, I'm going to get killed. Ah, man. There's another one there. Ah, man. These things just don't stop. Ah, we're going to have to take another. Oh, my gosh. I don't think we can do it. I might have to, like, leave through the ladder or something like that. There's no way out of here right now. Oh, wait, it ended. It ended. The toxic fog ended. That's good. That's good. Hold on. Golly, finally. Let's get some salmon berries going. Boom. We're probably at, what, 20% health? Yeah, 25. We're up to 36 now. Golly. There, let's get a few more. I want to get at least a half health. I'll feel comfortable at least at half health, but, man, that was a little bit too close for comfort. Still haven't found the way down to, uh, we're at level 13. Oh, no wonder. Man. Oh, wait, here we go. Finally. Thank you. Any iron down here? I know I'm not seeing what looks like any uh, iron down here, unfortunately. Let's get another one. We'll be oh, oh no, that's quartz. I was about to say, is that iron finally? But nah. Man. All right, let's break this. Get a little bit of uh, copper. Now, hopefully, uh, oh, by the way, yeah. Uh, how, how are we doing on, on that mission to kill slimes? It's 7 p.m. right now. I need to kill as many slimes as possible. I need to kill eight of them. But I'm just, oh, was that it? Oh, okay. Talk to Lewis. Okay. I might have to actually just leave the mines like right now. I I I, I feel like the adventure guild adventurers guild. I feel like uh, I need to actually go there when it's open, but I I feel like it's closed right now, right? Oh no, it closes at 10 p.m. Ooh. Uh oh, that's the way down. Hold on. Uh, we're at level 14. Do I want to keep going or what? Uh, should we try? Oh, elevator. Oh yeah, it's every five levels. I don't know why I was thinking just for a second there that it uh, is every ten level. Oh man, did it start fogging right there? I think it did. It's kind of weird. Either way, it's 8.30 p.m. Let's go over to uh, Lewis over here at the Adventurer's Guild. Let's go get our 480 dollars. I think it was 400 something dollars out of him uh, for doing that mission. So, uh, was it this guy? No, it was this guy, wasn't it? Is this Lewis? Come back when you've done something. Wait, who's Lewis? Oh, oh, I'm stupid. It was the, uh, it's the mayor guy. So, I don't, can I even talk to him right now? Because his, his, he, he'd be closed. There's no, yeah, the mayor's mayor. Well, it doesn't have an. It doesn't have hours there. It doesn't say, oh, it closes at uh, 2 p.m. or something. <laughs> Mayor's office is closing at 2 p.m. I'm like, that makes sense, considering hacking the way government works, right? <laughs> Always taking breaks and stuff. Being lazy. Let's grab that horse rash right there. Uh, what are we actually missing, though? I think, I th yeah, I think the only things we're missing are actual crops. I don't, I don't think there's any, like, wild things that we're missing, unfortunately. So I'll grab some more of these uh, berries here, though. It's 9.30 p.m. I don't know. I feel like I could break into his house right now, which is such a such a weird thing to say just out loud casually like that. But uh, it's it's so true. Like I I just basically need to go over to Heckin' Mayor's house, talk to him. Hopefully he's fine with me going to his house at about 10 Heckin' p.m. and being like, hey, you know those eight slimes that you wanted to kill by today? Oh, well, it's 10 p.m. right now. Hopefully I can actually go in there and talk to him about this. Can I? It's locked. 8:30 to 10 p.m. You're kidding me? I was just that late. Hopefully I could still because I'm like I killed him before the the time limit or whatever there man uh, and I, by the way i i keep getting comments from you guys like saying that i'm missing like worms or clay or whatever wiggling in the background like i'm, I'm not i'm not always going to be able to pay attention to the entire map uh, all the time like i'm going to be focusing on one thing or another or something like that i might notice it if it's like in the corner of my eye or something like that and i notice that the slight wiggling going on like that one time whatever we first saw it like right there uh, but other times, like I'm, I'm, I'm probably going to, admit, I'm just going to out, outright admit, I'm going to admit, or I'm going to miss most, if not all, the heckin' wailing worm guys that are in the ground. I'm, I'm just not going to be paying attention to them all the time. So, and I think that's like kind of the appeal of it as well. Like they want to be kind of hidden. They, they, you can only really see them when you're looking for them. You know, just like last episode, I didn't, I never saw them unless I was actively out looking for them. So, you know, if I'm doing something else and it's happening in the corner of my eye, I'm not really going to notice it. Either way, uh, is there anything here I want to actually sell? I'm like the slime, monster loot. I get rid of that sap. I don't know if we could use that for anything. Uh, mineral, uh, earth, min or earth crystal. 
We can uh, donate that to the museum, which I, I definitely want to check whether or not we could actually donate that to the museum like a second time because we already have an earth crystal there, you know, so I don't know if we could actually give it a second one. And uh, by the way, yeah, some of you guys were saying the person who wants the amethyst is Abigail. Abigail, I'm like the, the girl who's like all dressed in purple, has like purple hair and stuff like that, you know, uh, that just makes sense. I don't know why I never thought of it. Oh, man, maybe Abigail wants the, the, the purple rock. I don't know, I never thought of it. I keep the Earth Crystal in my inventory, though. The bait, kind of want to keep that in my inventory as well, just so I kind of use it. And then Wild Horse Rash. I don't know if I need that for anything. I might just... Uh, should I sell that? Uh, I don't know. Like, I could. I don't, th I don't think anything needs the Wild Horse Rash, though, so uh, I'll get I'll get a little bit of money out of it. Uh, there you go. And put it... Oh, whoa, what in the world? There's like a giant owl or something like that flying through the air right there. That's kind of crazy. Anyways, uh, Let's go to bed. Let's go to sleep for the night. See how much more. Oh, level one combat plus five HP. That's good. So we're up to 105 health now instead of 100. New craft recipe, bug steak ew, and a sturdy ring. Oh, yeah. And I got a comment from someone saying, yeah, don't buy it. Oh, wow. We actually got $40 from the forging right there and 35 from the slime. Uh, someone saying not to buy that ring. What was it called? Like the Topaz ring or something like that from the Adventures Guild. I wasn't really interested in it anyways. Like it didn't seem too appealing to me, but I uh, also got a comment from someone saying whenever you sell stuff overnight, you should click on it over here. And it'll actually uh, do a bigger breakdown of all the resources. I'm like, I only sold one forging thing, one other thing. Uh, but like, like beforehand, like I sold a bunch of stuff like at the end of the last episode. Definitely makes sense to hit this little plus sign and see what each thing gave me in terms of money and kind of add up there and get a little bit of a receipt, if you will. But either way, starting day 19. Oh, oh, you know what? Did we miss a? Oh, I feel like we missed a birthday. Hold on. Uh, let's see. Let's let's check the fortune teller. Okay, new troll today, and it's raining. What was it going to be tomorrow, though? Uh, okay, clear and sunny all day tomorrow. Okay, that that's good. I like the sound of that. Okay, it's raining right now. Uh, these things didn't don't seem like they have any progress going, but not that big of a deal. We do have some uh, mail here, though. Farmer Waffle, I have a request for you. I need fresh cauliflower for a recipe I want to make. Could you bring me one? Jody. Who's Jody again? I'll accept the quest, because I th think... Oh, no, I think we grabbed all the... Yeah, see, I'm not I'm not growing any cauliflower right now, unfortunately. Man. All right, well, I'll tell that right there. Uh, by the way, another thing you guys were saying... Uh, remember last episode, we actually unlocked the sprinkler, and I'm able to make this... Oh, that's that's what I wanted to make, the sprinkler. That's what required the iron, right? Uh, yeah, one iron bar. See, I'm, I need three more iron ore in order to make that. In order to make the iron bar. In order to make that. Because uh, we have three iron here somewhere. Where is that? There it is right there. Uh, so I, I think I need to have five in order to actually get the ingot. Uh, but you guys were also saying, hey, don't even get that sprinkler. You, you should wait until you get a like a, like an upgraded sprinkler. But I don't know if I want to do that. Like, it definitely makes sense to go up the stairs without skipping any stairs, if you know what I mean. Or, or else I might trip. So <laughs> I don't know if I want to risk. A, I don't know if I want to skip out on anything there, you know, uh, even though like the, uh, the upgraded sprinkler you guys are talking about may be better and actually probably it straight up is better like it's it's going to be better than the heckin starter sprinkler right obviously but i'm like I, I have to progress through the game i can't just skip things you know especially if i have a way of making it at least a little bit easier than manually watering each thing by hand with a watering can at least it's going to be a little bit easier with that sprinkler right i don't know if i have to set up like some sort of a uh, watering like a, like an irrigation system or anything like that to the sprinkler or if it just works i don't know if that's the case so I guess we'll have to figure that out when the time comes, but uh, for right now, I want to head on over to the museum. Actually, uh, oh wait, it opens at 8 a.m. What's about to open up right now? Not that big of a deal. I also want to head on over to Robin, or what's his name? No, it's not Robin. This guy right here, Lewis. want to head on over to the mayor's area. See if he will give us the mission. Do we still have that mission? Oh no, it went away! I was literally like, ah, man. I could have got that mission, could have got $400. Ah, well, in the end, at least we unlocked level 15 and got a little bit more adventuring done in that cave, but missed out on Forge High. I guess I guess that's one way to learn. Hey, if you have a timed mission there, which, by the way, is that is that cauliflower mission? Is that? Uh... OK, it's not timed, so that's good, because those cauliflowers take a little while to grow. Right. And by the way, yeah, we need to uh, let's, let's go look at the calendar, because I'm, I'm pretty sure someone had a birthday relatively soon. And I'd hate if it was yesterday and I missed it, but I'm pretty sure we still gave them gave gifts to people, at least a decent amount of people. So I'm kind of nervous. Like, did I miss someone's? Oh, I did. I missed Pam's birthday yesterday, man. And I, I'm pretty sure I gave her some gifts, too. But tomorrow's Shane's birthday. Check Shane's stuff. Uh, how do I hear you? Now, now Pam, 
What could, what, what did she like? I already gave her a gift, which is good, but I'm pretty sure if I gave her a gift. Oh, and she liked salmon berries too? Man, I have a ton of salmon berries. I could have gave her one yesterday, but I don't know. Did I even, did I even run into her? I don't know. I feel like I haven't. Uh, but Alex, is this guy, uh, which, which one's the guy that worked at the Mart? Whatever the, Joe, Joe G Mart? I think his birthday is tomorrow. I, I just want to see what it, what is he like? Cause I, you get, you guys also did a uh, confirming the comments that I do need to like experiment around. Here we go. Golly, uh, 20 spring. Okay. Uh, but yeah, I do have to exp Okay. He like, he likes, uh, salmon berries as well. So that's good. Hopefully I can actually give him a salmon berry while he's working. Cause I'm like, that's the only place I know where he frequents is at the heck Joe G Mart or whatever. Or Joe D Mart. Oh, and by the way, there's a mission here, isn't there? Here we go. Help wanted. Uh, green slime hunters slay four green slimes in the local mine. I guess I'll accept that again. <laughs> At least this one's only four slimes this time, right? Oh, and, uh, Pierre's shop. I think I wanted to buy something here at Pierre's shop, right? I guess if anything, I could buy the cauliflower seeds. Twelve days to produce, though. That's a long time. Golly. Man. Like, like we're not going to get these until literally next month. Like, uh, we looked at the calendar just a minute ago, and there's only 28 days in a month. Or season, or whatever. You know, you guys know what I mean. Ooh. I guess we can get a, a few. We can get a three of them, I guess. That's that's good. Uh, we can sell a daffodil. Get a little bit of money. Uh, we can sell 37 salmon berries and get 185, which is... It's okay money, but I feel like that's a lot more valuable. You know, e eating them for energy and getting a little bit of health out of them and stuff like that, you know? I'll, I'll sell them the daffodil, though, just because we don't have anything I can really use that, you know? So I'll get rid of that. And uh, parsnips. I don't know if I'm growing any parsnips. I'll get a few of those. Beans. Oh, well, we're already growing those, so I didn't need to do that. And then potatoes. I do know we need potatoes. I'm trying to get everything that we have to grow for that one. And there's nothing. Else. Oh, and you basically retain. Yeah, we have a few of those, actually. Speed grow. Ooh, stimulates leaf production. Guaranteed to increase growth rate by at least 10% mixing with tilled soil. Okay, so if... Hold on, where was it? Oh, yeah, cauliflower. Oh, it's not going to show it there. But if the cauliflowers take 12 days to produce and it grows 10% faster, does that mean it will grow in only 11 days? Because it's 10% faster? I guess. Is that worth $100, though? Like, I don't really think so. Yeah, it seems like a little bit of a waste of money there, you know, but uh, I guess we can head on over to the mine. How, how much money do we get for that one, uh, Slay Monsters? 240 so I guess it, it, it kind of equates to the mission that we missed. <laughs> Even though we literally did the mission, I guess we got that mission done for free, so uh, I guess Lewis got off easy there. But uh, I, I'm pretty sure we had to kill eight slimes for that one, and we get like 400-something dollars, so killing four slimes, getting 240 uh, I'm not going to complain about that too much, but at the same time, that's a little, this early in the game, $480 or however much that was, that's a lot of money we're missing out on, you know? Like, we, we can get gear and whatnot. Yeah, I think... Wait, no, this is the sparkling route. Yeah, hold on. Journey Center... Or was it? Greenhouse. Glittering boulder remove. Is that what this is? So if we remove those glittering boulders, is... I wonder if... This will start working, because I guess the glittering boulders are, are are blocking the rail right here. Ooh. So if we do, what was it, the fish tank? Yeah, I, I guess if we do all the fish tank things over here, then I guess we'll be able to ride this little minecart right here. I don't know why, but I, 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 I that's kind of an interesting thing that we could do, right? <laughs> Either way, let's get our sword out. We have full health, full energy right now. There's a slime right off the bat, which is good. Just need to kill four of these guys. I'm about to kill our first. Boom! Already dead. Wow, that was amazingly fast. Oh, already got diglets over here. I do need to find. Oh, and there's a bug already. I don't see. I don't see like anything. There's like barely any rocks around here though. Uh, I didn't. I didn't get anything there. We have. I think it was neutral uh, luck today, so we're not gonna find a, a ladder like super duper quick. Although I do need to still be pretty heckin' quick though. I, I, I'm going to. I'm going to break my rules at least temporarily to hopefully find this ladder down. Yeah, I don't know. Oh, whoa, oh, oh, whoa, oh. whoa. I'm like, I guess if anything, I could just ride the ladder again. Or uh, ride the elevator again. Go, like, up and down, whatever else. And then, then hopefully I'll be able to find more slimes that way. But, uh, let's break all these. Yeah, I'm not having any luck finding I'm not even getting, like, anything good. I'm just getting stoned from all these. Which is already is better than nothing, but... Oh, here we go, finally. Okay, let's go down. There's a bug there. What's this weird music playing right now? Let's get rid of all that grass. Really weird dark spot here in the middle. That's kind of strange. Get that quartz. That's good money, I'm pretty sure. Oh, wow, there's a thing of, uh... Oh, and there's a ladder down already. You can barely see that. But, uh... Is that... Copper there? It looks slightly different. Seems like... Or maybe... Oh, wait! 
Topaz. Ooh, awesome. Okay, I wonder how much that's going to be. I'm sure someone really likes Topaz. You like, like, like how Abigail likes Amethyst, apparently? Someone's got to really love Topaz. I definitely want to... Oh, I wonder when Abigail's birthday is. I should def I should probably save that uh, Amethyst for her birthday. That definitely makes sense. If there's nothing else around here. I might just skip down to level, uh, layer, layer 17. Let's let's do that real quick. Yep, there, yep. Oh my gosh, a giant slime. Now, is this going to be like Minecraft where you kill it? It splits off into a bunch of smaller slimes? Oh, it did! Oh my gosh! This is good, this is good. So we have the mission done? Boom, talk to Lewis. Okay, we have two days to do it, though, so, uh, hold on. There's, like, a slime layer. Like, look, look the whole wall. The walls are, like, dripping with slime. There's a bunch of slimes all over the place. If I need to kill slimes, hey, head down to cell, uh, level 8, level 17. Wait, what is that up there? What is that? Why is there a skull on the, uh, the 17 right there? Does that mean a... Was that a boss? Or something? I don't know. Uh, do I not have inventory? Oh, wow, I don't have inventory space for this. Uh... I don't know, what, what do I want to get? I guess I'll get, I'll, I'll eat the spring onion, sure. And then, uh, did I really need to get that algae? I don't think so. <laughs> Man! Uh, we don't really have anything I want to drop, and then we have one random coal there. Do I really want to drop a coal for that sap? I'm pretty sure the coal's a little bit more valuable than the sap, right? Uh, oh, whoa, 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 whoa! Why am I holding the earth crystal above my head? I think there's another big slime there on the bottom left. Oh, man! Yep, yep, he's like guarding something there. Oh, we got slimed. Now is there gonna is there like another diglet that's gonna pop out of the wa out of the whatever this is the sand here? <laughs> oh yeah, even the ground is covered in slime. I didn't even notice it until now. Golly, that's nasty. There's like a slime light bulb right there, <laughs> and we got bugs chasing after us again. No, man, these guys are so annoying. Well, hopefully I'm killing these guys a little bit faster than I would have with a rusty sword, right? But uh, here's a big slime that's guarding this area here. I wonder if I kill all... Oh man, I probably do have to kill all the slimes to progress to the next level. But thankfully we have two days to go back to Lewis. Here we go, here we go. They're all grouped up, all cornered. Come on, keep swiping at them. Oh man, one of them jumped behind me. Okay, I got all those right there. Oh man, killed one right there. And then boom, that one's dead too. Nice. Making great progress killing all these guys. Oh man. Either I have to, I, I, like, I don't know, either I have to kill all the slimes, oh man, we got a bug! Come on, kill the bug! Ah, oh, man, I'm, try, I'm trying to kill the slimes, trying to kill the bugs all at the same time. Man, I'm taking damage too, I need to eat those, uh, those berries. Ah, oh, man, okay, I killed that slime. Here we go, here we go, doing damage. Oh, he's jumping, boom, got him. Boom, got him, okay, let's eat these. Eat the salmon berries, get a little bit of health back, at least get up to, like, half health. I feel a lot more comfortable. Alright, let's go, let's go. It's gotta be at either the end of this or after we kill all the slimes. Oh, there's another slime right there, okay. Eat, eat some more salmon berries, just to kind of be comfortable. Wait, yeah, look at this, it's a dead end! Wait, what? Or is that what the, uh, hold on, yeah, that's probably what the skull- Yeah, we, we probably have to kill every slime, that's probably what that skull symbolizes. Hey, you can't leave unless you kill everything and turn them into egg and skulls, even though- Pretty sure a slime doesn't have skull, right? It's literally nothing but just goo. <laughs> Green goo. <laughs> but either way, uh, let's keep looking around here, see if we can find anything else, like iron ore or something like that. Like, I don't know. There's quartz over there. Oh, wait, whoa, 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 what's that? What are those? There's, like, creatures over there, and there's, a uh, coal right here. Let's grab that, boom. Yeah, I, I remember seeing that previously. Oh, man, we got one of those dumb bugs heading over here. There you go. We're doing actually pretty well on health. I thought we'd be doing way worse on health, honestly. There you go. Bug meat right there. What are these? These bugs do- Ew! What in the- Ew! No, ew! They're like little maggot worms or something. Ah! Nasty! Ew! Get them out of here! Oh my- Whoa, whoa! Carrot! What? Wait, huh? Hold on. I need to drop something. I don't know what I'm going to drop. I need to figure it out, but... I kind of want to get that carrot. I feel like the carrot's somewhat rare. Is it- Okay, it drop. Okay, drop the algae. I'll, I'll eat the green. Hold on, wait, what? Oh, it actually. Hold on, yeah, it gives you a little bit of health, a little bit of energy. Sure, I'll eat it. <laughs> there you go. I was about to drop it and just just waste it, I guess. But uh, let's get full energy, a little bit of health, and uh, of course that inventory slot right there. Now I may be able to pick up this carrot here. Uh, rice shoot. Ooh, I didn't even notice that. That was a carrot. <laughs> Either way, let's try and find our way out of here though, because I am on 18. If we can go down to 20, we'll be able to unlock the next elevator, like, stop. And, of course, probably get some more loot. Remember, whenever we uh, got to layer 10, we got our leather boots that we have on right now. Oh, man, there we go. So I wonder if we're going to get, like, a chest piece, maybe uh, gauntlets or 
something else, maybe a helmet or something like that, you know? Well, let's break this big rock. This is, this is like basically breaking four rocks right here, so maybe the ladder's underneath this. No, wow, I'm actually kind of surprised. Nothing was underneath that. <laughs> and let's keep breaking even more rocks, try and find a... Uh... Like, you know what, it kind of makes sense to come over here when if you have a good luck day. Just so you can kind of speed through all this kind of stuff. I know there was one mission. Oh, we found it, nice. Oh, oh, there's a bug. I know there was one mission or something, some sort of achievement, I think, right? Where you uh, get to like level, layer 40 or 50 or something like that. Oh, and there's one back here. I don't know how I walked right past this. Uh, but we're almost halfway there. We're at uh, almost level layer 20, which is great. I just need to find the stairs out here, and then we can actually unlock the next stop for the elevator and probably get some good loot. Let's break some more, uh, there you go. It's kind of confusing. Sometimes it looks like you can, you can walk by things, but you actually can't. It's kind of strange. Oh man, there's an earth something there. Oh, can I eat this fiber? Nah. I think I have plenty of this. Like, can I just drop it? I kind of want to. Like, I have plenty of that at home. There you go. Geode! Oh yeah, we need to go to the blacksmith and he'll open up that. Hold on. Uh, okay, I think I have to break through all this if I want to keep going, yeah. And there's like a big room down there with what looks like multiple barrels that we could open. Ooh, kill this bug. There we go, nice. And, wow, this is a huge room. I'm like, it is the last room until layer 20, right? Which I'm pretty sure is the layer that, oh, yeah, and then we have full inventory. Nah, not that big of a deal. But I'm pretty sure layer 20 is the last one. Like, that one has the elevator. And we can just straight up leave. There's a box here. Oh, wow, that's that's that hardwood or whatever, right? Ah, uh, what do I want to drop to get that? Uh, man. I don't know why I have that fish in my inventory, though. I should have sold that overnight. Man. Uh, let's see. Do I want to... I can't eat it. Oh, yeah, I can, actually. Ooh, get a little bit of uh, energy and health. But I have two of those fish. We can get good money out of that. What do I want to drop? I'm like, we already have bait. Do I really need, like, eight bug meat? Stone. I feel like that that's a lot more valuable. Oh, gosh. Now we got these bugs. Well, that, wait, oh, man, you know what? Oh, man, right, right when I was about to say that. Oh, man, look at that, you guys. We haven't had uh, the green fog smoke stuff at all. Right when I was about to say that, we have it just pop up right there. All right, let's get rid of that. And I suppose we just trash it. Boom, there you go. I don't care. Not that big of a deal. Oh, my gosh, two bugs at the same time. All right, at least maybe I'll be able to kill them both with one swipe. Oh, my gosh, three of them, now four of them, what? Come on, I'm getting swarmed over here. I can't kill everything at once. Oh, my gosh, five of them. How in the six of them? What? Oh my gosh, I'm trying my best. I'm going to. Oh my gosh, every time I kill one, another one comes back, and there are bug guts everywhere, and I'm getting killed by the heck and smoke. Okay, the smoke is gone. That's good. The green smoke is finally heck and gone. Eat some of these heck and salmon berries. Slurp those up, Peta. Get some health, get some energy. Oh man, and there's like maggots in front of me, too. Oh, this is disgusting. But thankfully, in the center there, there are going to be multiple barrels, multiple. Uh, boxes that we could open hopefully get some great loot out of all that so it's going to be worth it here in the end you guys so let's kill these little maggot guys there you go boom boom there you go we got him oh we got him oh we got another rice shoot right there nice stuff now what is that hold on there's another thing right there man i don't want to drop i don't know if i want to drop i guess if we drop the slimes okay drop the drop the slime there you go oh whoa a carving knife small light blade with a two uh, plus two crit chance. What? Hold on. Let's move all these over. How does this work? Oh, it's like ultra short range, but you can spam it. Oh. But this one is a, a broader range. You can swipe here, so bigger area of effect. You can spam this super. Hold on. How, how fast? Oh, man, I was about to plant something right there. How fast can I actually spam this? Spamming that as fast as I can right there. You guys probably remember from Terraria, I could spam things pretty heckin' fast sometimes. But, uh, yeah, I guess we can test it out on the slime. Yeah, especially with slimes, keeping them at bay, they never get right next to you. Like, I can't really even see what's going on right now, but, uh, yeah, this slime is constantly taking one, 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 and occasionally it gets a two. <laughs> but, uh, it goes down right there. Let's kill these. Oh, man! Bunch of stuff right here. Am I able to... I'm not able to attack multiple things at once, I don't believe, but, uh, here we go, here we go. I am, uh, keeping them all at bay, you know, one at a time, basically, which is great. Killing that rock crab, boom. Oh, man, there's a maggot just turned blue. What? Is that a... Oh, it turned into a... Oh, my gosh, it turned into that bug. Okay, I'm going... Oh, we got a crab! I need the crab. I need that. I need that for the... For the... Oh, man, I have no inventory space. It's 1230 as well. 
Come on, kill the dumb bug! Oh man, I'm gonna I'm gonna pass out here, aren't I? Okay, get rid of the rocks. Okay, just get rid of the rocks. I need the crab. Wait, what did I just pick up right there? I just picked up a bug meat. Ah, oh, man. There, I got the crab. Perfect. Okay. Awesome. Okay, let's go. Let's get the heck out of here. Spending way too much time. It's 1 a.m. I need to leave. I need to get out of here. I need to get the layer 20. Like, right now. Okay, there you go. We can get the layer 20 right now, but uh, there's like a lot of stuff inside of here. Okay, I got another earth crystal. It's one. Oh my gosh. I'm not going to make it home. I'm going to lose money. Ah, oh my gosh, another amethyst. We're getting a lot of stuff right now, but... Seeds and whatnot. Whoa, what are those? A lot of wood and... Ah, some other stuff. A lot of stone right there. Hold on. Kind of want to get those, like, mixed seeds and stuff like that, but I can't. Ah, man, what am I going to drop? I don't know. I don't have the room. Ah, man. Oh, I'm going to pass out here. Ah, man. Coal? I guess we'll get rid of that. What is that? Cave carrot. <gasps> we finally have the cave carrots, you guys. Ah, uh, we got heckin' things coming over here, too. Get the heck away! Go to level 20. Here we go. <gasps> what is it? What is it? Give me the loot! Steel small sword! Don't mind if I do. 4 to 8 down. Okay, get rid of that. Pfft. I don't care about that garbage. We got a better thing right there, you guys. Let's go. Let's go to level uh, 0. Are we going to pass out in the mines? I think we are. You got- Yo! <sighs> Man, we're cutting it close there. I know we're going to we're at 751. We're going to lose like I don't know like seven dollars, seven seven seventy dollars. I don't know something like that. I think you lose like ten percent of your health or uh, your money. Uh, that's just what I think happened last time and like the other time before that too. But either way, level two combat plus five HP. So we're at 110 health now and a new crafting recipe for a life elixir. Hey, there you go. Strategically passing out there, making sure that we actually get everything done that we wanted to get done. Yeah, see, we went down about uh, seventy bucks right there. Not too bad, I guess. Uh, of course, if I had way more money, we would have lost way more money. Thankfully, it rained yesterday, so it doesn't really matter that uh, I didn't manually water all the crops and whatnot. But speaking of watering crop crops, we need to do that today. It looks like one of the parsnips or something like that is ready to go, so that's good. Let's actually plant some stuff over here, such as the cave carrots that we actually got. I don't know if does that need to be a. Uh... Yeah. Okay. So it looks like do I, I I might need to actually plant that in the caves. Like a literal case, so that's probably what this is over here. And hey, look at that, there's Zongus over there. <laughs> Good morning there, Zongus. And of course we got that new sword, that's definitely worth it. That's definitely, I, I will pay that $70 to essentially get that sword there at the very end. See, right here, I wouldn't be surprised if that turns into the greenhouse uh, for doing that. Uh, which mission, I don't know, I forget which mission that was. But uh, Cave Karis, do I plant it here? Hold on, do I till the ground here? What do I do with a Cave Carrot? Starchy snacks found in caves that works or helps miners work longer. I guess you can't just plant this. I guess you just get the cave carrot and you could, I guess, either sell it, maybe get some money. Oh! Hold on, I think I think the community, something in the community center, that might want the cave carrot. Where would that be? Quality? Nah. Summer? Nah. Artisan? Nah. All? No. Animal? No. It must be. Winter foraging, no. Summer, no. Exotic, yes, exotic. Okay, we need to give a uh, cave carrot to the exotic foraging bundle in the community center. And then uh, we have hardwood, we can give it two. I didn't know I had two of them, but we need 10 in total. So we're gonna be a fifth of the way there in terms of uh, giving it the hardwood. Which shouldn't be too hard to get all the other wood. I think it needed a 99 and then another 99. So, you know, look at all these trees around my base. If I just cut all these down, clear the area out, <laughs> I'm sure I'll get uh, 200 wood for that. Uh, but for right now, I guess we'll put up some of the stuff that we don't need in our inventory right now. And, and, yeah, you know what? You know what? Speaking of such, we have a lot of seeds in our inventory. We need to plant them down. Like, I was going to do that with the... What in the world is this? What is that brown stuff? Is that... I don't know what that is. I'm, I'm just going to let it continue to grow, though. But, uh, it's till this land that I'm standing on that... There you go. Regrew back on its own. And water that. I guess I could just water that before anything is even planted, which is interesting. So, there you go. Get the beanstalk going. And, uh, get the potatoes going. So, uh, here we go. And there you go. Okay. Well, let me uh, let me continue plant or uh, watering all this because I barely watered anything over here. And we have a lot of crops going on. And I think we have like a parsnip or something up there. Is that is that a, what is that? Oh, that was a potato right there. Ooh, that's good. I think are these potatoes too? Yep, more potato, potato. Hey, grab all those hot potatoes. Oh, literally a hot potato right there. A gold star, hot potato. Nice. Even a silver star right there too. Great stuff. Good money. Let's fill up our watering can again. Uh, I don't think, oh yeah, we do need a potato for the, uh, for the, whatever it's called, but I do also need parsnips too. 
Uh, remember, all, like all these seeds here in the middle, those were the 30 random spring seeds. So I don't know what these two are right here, uh, but we got potatoes there randomly. And uh, I don't know, is that probably going to be a beanstalk or something? I don't know. Uh, either way, what was I going to do? Am I, going, am I continuing to plant stuff here? I guess I don't have any uh, more seeds. Oh, wait, no, I have this. Rice shoot. Plant these in the spring. It takes eight days to... Wait, so how does this work if... Do the do all the crops just immediately die on the first of summer? Like I just planted down the cauliflowers. Those take twelve days. Is that a waste? And oh, of course, yeah, we have the crab as well. We need to donate that too. I don't know, you guys. Huh? Either way, uh, we have mail here. Let's see. Uh, man, why can't I open up the? What? Why can't I open up the? Jeez, there we go. Golly. Oh, yeah, they're just telling me that someone dropped me off. <laughs> Waffles, someone dropped you off at the uh, clinic last night. You passed out from exhaustion. Yeah, I know. I was in the caves all day. Literally. Like, I was in there in the morning, and I was in... Actually, I was in there at night, and then again the next day. Two days straight. You've, uh, you've got to take better care of yourself and go to bed at a reasonable hour. I know. I'm addicted to this game. You don't have to tell me twice, game. Uh, I've billed you 75 gold to cover your medical expenses. That makes sense. Not really that bad. 10% uh, of my money. Not too bad, I suppose. Uh, we have two amethysts right now, so I guess I'm more comfortable giving, uh, whatever her name is, at least one of those. Abigail. Uh, then the hardwood. I do want to donate that. Just kind of get that out of the way, and I, I guess we can open up the geode. Sell that uh, small fish. And, uh, topaz. I guess we can donate that. Quartz. Oh, I can donate quartz as well. I didn't know that. Uh, I guess I'll put up the, uh, there you go. Put the copper up. Cherry bombs. I don't need to have them, but I guess I'll keep them. At least for right now. Uh, and definitely wanted, you know what, yeah, we had, we had so many opportunities in that cave to heck and use the cherry bombs, I forgot about them. And they're in the second part of the, uh, the, the hot bar down there, so, that's why I forgot about them, they're in the, you, you kind of have to, to, to switch over to them, so. You should definitely, you know what, yeah, let's, let's move that over to the main hot bar. Here we go. Just so I don't forget about it. And, uh, we have the dagger now, we have the big sword here. Is mirrors faster than that wood sword? Doesn't say anything about, uh... Oh, yeah, it does! Plus two speed! Ooh! So it is four to eight damage, plus two speed. And the daggers are... What are they again? One to three, and then plus two critical chances. So, uh, critical, I assume, just like every other game, means it does double damage for that, uh... If it gets a critical. So that'd be really good. Uh, you know, take it on bigger enemies and whatnot, doing more damage. But, I do want to... Oh, yeah. Let's go up here to Pierre. Let's go sell him some stuff. Uh, and then we have another mission right here. I guess we... Oh, yeah. We also need to go to... Uh, what is his name? The mayor guy. Because we got that mission done. Oh, hey, here's Abigail. Amethyst. Gift. You already get... Oh, man! I've already given her two gifts this week. If only she knew what I had my hands ready for her. Uh, let's see. Social. Okay. Oh, yeah, today's Saturday. Now, does the, does the week reset on Sunday or Saturday for, uh, this, this game? Because sometimes some calendars reset on, like, Sunday's the last day of the week. Some calendars Saturday's the last day of the week. Okay, so it is Sunday, the last day. Okay, so I'll have to wait till tomorrow, and then it'll reset. So, either way. Oh, yeah, today's Shane's birthday. I can give him a, uh... Let's go, let's go to jo Joja Mart. Let's actually... Hold on. Let's sell him some stuff real quick. Cave Care, I can, I can get some money out of that. Only 100 for four. You only get 25 each. That's nothing. Kind of want to sell the Gold Star Potato, get the Silver Star Potato. Let's get some money out of those. Can I sell... Why can't I sell the fish? Oh, yeah, I, I think I have to sell that to Willie, right? Yeah. The potato, I definitely want to keep those. Yeah, okay, well, uh, we're at $896 right now. Hopefully, Willie gives us good money for those, uh, oh, wow, what in the world? Like, three people all in a line just walking right there. But, uh, let's go over to the mayor's house over here. Let's go see what he's up to. Hopefully, we get, uh, what was it, like, $280, $240 from him for doing that killing the four slimes mission? Wait, what, where is he? He's not here. Oh, wait, no, is wait, what is this drop box? The town's lost and found box. Can I actually put anything in there? I guess not. What are these books? Pelican Town Ledger Book. It looks like the mayor uses this to keep track of finances. That's good. What about this one? Pelican Town Ledger. Oh, wait. Are there two of them? I guess so. There's a green book there and like a purple pink book. Uh, they're both the same thing, I guess. So, either way, where am I going? Jojo Mart. Let's go over to Jojo Mart. Hopefully, hopefully I can actually give that guy a gift while he's on duty. So, oh, wait. No, there's the, uh, the mayor guy. Hold on. Ah, oh, Waffle, so you helped us with our slime problem? Thank you. Yeah, I also helped you with your slime problem. The eight slimes like the day before, so I'd kind of like that money too, but I know you're not going to pay me. <laughs> I hope you didn't go too, through too much trouble. I'm like, I died, and I lost $75, so, uh, you know, if you could make up for that, that'd be good. You know, help pay the medical expenses and whatnot. <laughs> I know it could be really hard to get that sticky slime off your clothes, or out of your clothes. 
I've definitely ruined a few good pairs of pants trying to catch those little squirmers. I can remember Papa going into a rage after I got slivery slime all- or silvery slime all over my brand new silk. Wait, what is silvery? It must be like a special slime. We've only seen like green slimes. Oh, pants. <laughs> well, anyways, enjoy your reward. Hey, I will. $240 or something? Yep, 240 Noise or gold, you guys know what I mean. Either way, what other mission do we have here? Jody's request. Well, sorry I didn't give you a gift on your birthday there, Jody. Uh, well, here's the museum, by the way. We, we could donate stuff here uh, still. So let's talk to Gunther. Let's give him multiple things. We have quartz, yes. So we could put, uh, just kind of want to, here you go. Kind of stagger things a, a little bit. There you go. Whoa, a new reward. What? What is that? What'd I get? Did I get anything special? Well, can I talk to him? Like, hey, there you go, here you go, what is it? Cauliflower, nine of them! Wait, I can only grow those in the spring and it takes 12 days! I can't even, uh, scam! Scammed! Ah, uh, I guess I have to save those until next year, huh? Man! Well, that sucks, I guess Gunther just had some trash laying around in his pockets and he was like, hey, I guess you'll accept this as a gift. <laughs> Quartz, a clear crystal commonly found in caves and mines, that's true. What about the topaz? Uh, topaz, fairly common, but still prized for its beauty. Yeah. Uh, I wonder how many... Oh, yeah, am I able to donate multiple? Oh, yeah, it didn't let me donate the amethyst, did it? Yeah, so I guess you can't donate the same thing twice. Hold on, uh, doesn't... See... Yeah, see, it doesn't seem like you have anything to donate in the museum, yeah. Because I already donated the amethyst, and I have one in my inventory now. Who... Hold on, who's this guy? Is this some guy that starts with H? Yeah, Harvey. Can I do anything for you? Well, I guess I can't answer that question, I guess. That sucks. Either way... Uh, let's go to Jojo Mart. Oh, actually, hold on. Yeah, we're here at the Blacksmith. We have a Geo, don't we? I think he's still open. I think he closed at four. Yep, here we go. Here we go. Blacksmith upgrade tool. Process Geode. Oh, we have two of them. Ooh. Okay, what's inside? Whoa, whoa, what is that? Wait, whoa, Jamborite. Ooh, interesting. We gotta go back to the mo- Oh, whoa, whoa, was that clay? Ah, yeah, it's just clay. Trash. <laughs> Alright, well, we paid 50 buckaroos right there. We got a heckin' green sun looking thing and a little bit of clay a little little wiggly wormy little clay there it, wait what did it oh no that was just a sign right there i was about to say it closed <laughs> that wouldn't make any sense donate to the museum here you go gunther can tell you more about this okay so uh what do i want to do here i don't want to put a green next to a green i kind of want to get some good variety going on here so uh should i place it over here maybe uh hmm, i want to get do I want to start, like, filling out this whole row here, or do I want to spread everything out a little bit? You know, let's spread it out a little bit. Let's put that right there. Noise. Because I'm like, we already have things spread out right now, you know? One on that corner, one there. Uh, one in the center, one there. And one there and there, in the middle. Just kind of spreading things out a bit. Well, let's learn about this... What was it called again? Jamborite. The crystals are so tightly packed, it almost looks fuzzy. Huh. You know, I never heard of that. I kind of want to Google, like, what Jamborite is. See if it actually does look fuzzy. Unless it's, like, a made-up thing. I definitely have to look up that, but, uh, we're at, uh, almost a 50-minute mark already for this video, you guys. It's kind of crazy. I guess, uh, real quick, though, we can just kind of, do, do, you know, tie up some loose ends here before we end off the episode. Let's, let's go down to Willie. Oh, wait, no, is that what? Hold on. If the local fishing scene got a little bit more lively, I might expand on the ship's, or shop's stock. Yeah, hold on, come down here. I, I need to actually sell you. Oh, what in the... Pfft? I need to actually sell you something, so if you come down here, that'd be really nice. Oh yeah, don't we? Yeah, we also need uh, like seashells or something like that, right? Oh no, I think the only, yeah, I think the only thing we're missing for the uh, for the for the like aquarium, like what, what was it called again? Hold on, it's over here. Fish tank? No, not that one. Night fishing? No. Crab pot? Yeah. Oh yeah, the only yeah the only thing we're missing is the crab, which we have, which is great. So we're gonna have that done, which is awesome. So that's going to be the second one done. Oh yeah, another thing I wanted to test was. You guys said to fish from the rock. I don't know how to get over there. I, I guess you have to, like, uh, swim or something to get over there. I don't know how to do that. With this random, like, box right there. Hmm. Either way, it's like 4 p.m. on a Saturday. Is he? I don't know. He might be closed on Saturdays now, I think about it. Because remember, uh, Pierre's is closed on, like, Wednesdays. Random. Oh, wait, no, wait, what in the world? Uh, well, he's not even here, so, uh, oh, wait, he has an upstairs. It leads to a little sleeping cubby. It's off limits, so, okay, well, he's not here. It's locked. Okay, so the back door is locked. Oh, I guess I'm working here, working the register. I'm gonna steal out of the register. <laughs> well, so where's Willie at? I just want to sell him a fish or two and get hopefully get some good money, but I'm just not here. Oh, hey, look at this. We have some clams, and I, I guess we can get some money out of that, or a cockle. Get a little bit of money out of that, but 
I, I kind of want to just head to the community center. If he's not going to be here, if he's not going to hang out around... Yeah, see, look at that. He's fishing in the river right there. Oh, well, I guess, yeah. There are some fish, like river fish, lake fish there. I guess ocean fish down here. Inter I never really thought about that until now, but yeah, there are specific fish that the community center wants, and those are different locations you could head to. Yeah, I don't know what my luck is today, by the way. I, I, I might wait until, like, it's almost nighttime or something like that to <laughs> rummage through the trash cans. I'll probably do that a little bit later, but for right now, let's go over to the community center. Let's go drop off. Man, I don't know how many things we actually have, honestly. Like, we have a lot of them. Look at that little guy right there. There's a guy over there, and there's a guy over there, too. Oh, there's all, they're all over the place. Oh. Drop off the crab, though, just because it's the closest one here. It's a crab pot. Crab. Boom! Bundle complete. Nice. Hopefully we get something good. There it is right there. There's our reward, and it just flowered right there. Crab pot. Three of those. Whoa! Place it in the water, load it with bait, and check the next day to see if you caught anything. Works in streams, lakes, and the ocean. <laughs> That's perfect. So I, I want to put, we have three of them. I want to put one of them in a stream, uh, aka, I guess, a river. Uh, interchangeable words there. I want to put one in the lake, and also one in the ocean, and then just, we have bait. We have ten bait. I definitely want to see what we get out. Oh, whoa. Oh, did we unlock the boiler room? And whatever that safe. Oh, we did. Cool. Did we unlock? No, I guess we didn't unlock that up there either. Uh, maybe maybe here in just a bit because we're going to finish uh, another thing here in just a sec. But let's see what this is. Boiler room. Blacksmith's bundle. Copper bar. Okay, copper bar, iron bar, gold bar. We could do copper right now, but, you know, do I want to donate that right now? Earth crystal. I could do that. We have quartz as well. We have... Wait, what is that? Frozen tier fire quartz? I wouldn't be surprised if... That that stuff that we find a lot deeper down. That's probably we have we probably have to come back. Oh whoops. We have to come back here uh, once we reach like maybe like little 50 of the mines or something like that, you know. And then not ah I should have kept all that. We had like 20 or something like that, right? Especially in that one room where you kill a bunch of slimes. And especially the big ones that turn into smaller ones. Man, and then we need 10 bat wings and solar essence and then void essence. Once again, probably something you find from killing like bosses or something like that. I don't know. Uh, a little bit deeper down in the mines. Uh, but killing these slimes, I could have made some good progress there, but I dropped them because I wanted to make inventory space. Geologist bundle. Blacksmith. Okay, I already looked at all those. Uh, let's go over to... Uh, where am I going? I, I just need to drop off the potato. And then... Some hardwood. Yeah, I don't... Uh, yeah, I don't think we're actually going to finish anything right now, are we? Yeah. Man, that'll suck then. Either way, let's go over to the pantry. Let's see if we can actually drop anything off over here. I think we can, but... Uh, yeah, we can drop off a potato. So there you go. Parsnip and green bean. We should have those somewhat soon. Actually, I think we might have green beans. I, I never actually tried to harvest from the green beans. I wouldn't be surprised if those were actually ready to go. Exotic forgery. Oh, yep. Uh, cave carrot. Perfect. What else do we have here? Earth crystal. Hardwood. Yeah, where was that? Fall foraging. Construction. Yes. So two hardwood. Oh, wait. Whoa, wait. What? What? Oh, I bet I have to. Yeah, I have to donate them all at once. I can't just donate like a little bit here and a little bit there and then have it add up. Ooh. Okay, that makes it a little bit more interesting. There's a gold star cockle. Golly, I didn't notice those things could be, uh, like, have different rarity and what that. That's kind of interesting. Either way, uh, 6.20 p.m. I guess we can go home, start looking forward to next episode, end off this heckin' episode. Once again, nearing the one hour long mark, so I really need to settle down over here, you guys. But we did still get some good progress done. Got some really good gear now in, ter in terms of uh, a new sword, a dagger. Was this clean? Oh! A field snack, nice. Yep. There we go. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. I... oh no, it's just a sword uh, resetting right there. The cooldown resetting, so that's good. Oh, a can of soda. Jojo Cola. Oh, yeah. The guy working at Jojo Mart. Where is he at? If he's not over here in Jojo Mart working, he's got to be in the saloon. I'm pretty sure we saw him. In... Oh, there's that guy. Pretty sure we saw him working or uh, hanging out in the saloon. And it's Saturday night, too. So he'll definitely be there, right? Where is he? Is he here? Yeah, I guess he's not uh, working today. Either that or he's already done. Okay. Well, it's so weird how... Oh, that's where this guy is. Yeah. Yeah, that guy that, like, savagely gave, like, what was it? 50% off coupons when Pierre's shop and sold off his customers last episode? That's where this this guy works, I thought. He was, like, one of the higher-ups that worked in, like, corporate or something like that. But no, he, he's, like, the manager at Jojo Mario itself right there. It's kind of stupid. Oh, man, there's an owl right there. Look at that. Either way, uh, almost 8 p.m. right now. Let's go to the saloon. Hopefully there's people here. Like, there's the blacksmith guy, and there's, uh, Sebastian right there. I don't know if I want to give him anything right now. I don't know when his birthday is. Let's see. Oh, wait, yeah, there's that guy right there. Let's give him, here we go, a gift for his birthday. No, do not eat his favorite thing in front of him. No, do not eat the, his favorite thing in front of him. 
You remember my birthday. I'm impressed. Thanks. Hey, no problem, Shane. So, uh, can I give him another gift? No, do not eat that in front of him. No, do not eat that in front of him. You've already given, uh, um, oh, okay. I was about to say, like, maybe I can give him two gifts on the same day and have it count for the same week. But, uh, yeah, you can only do one a, one a day. Forgot about that. Can't talk to a Willy there to try and sell him anything, which sucks. Wait, can I? I don't think I have. Did I give Willy a, uh, Sandberry already? Hmm. You like stuff like this? Huh. Uh, I guess he doesn't. That's kind of the vibes I'm getting from that, honestly. Pam, uh. Oh, yeah, I think I already gave her stuff, right? You did good with this one. Oh, I guess I didn't give her two gifts this week. I guess we, uh. And then Leah here. I'm, I'm kind of. I, I kind of feel like if I give her that, she's not going to like it. Hold on. Leah. Oh, wait, I already gave her two gifts. Oh, she does like, uh, salmon berries, so that's good. But I already gave her two gifts this week, so. Oh, look at this, look at this, look at this. Heart, heart on Demetrius, Pam, Robin, Shane, two hearts. I guess we got a bonus heart there because we gave one on, uh, a favorite thing on his birthday. We're making good progress, you guys. This is good. This is great. Let's actually talk, let's just generally, just casually just talk to people. So, uh, Leah. Uh, I love to decorate for different seasons. Hey, who doesn't, I guess, right? Pam, let's talk to you. Pam isn't responding. I'm not surprised. She's probably wasted. <laughs> I always see Clint here, but he won't talk to anyone. He just glances over his shoulder uh, now and then. Now, who's Clint? Is that the blacksmith? I think so. Wait, he's talking to Willie, isn't he? Yeah, here's Clint. Sometimes I wonder how he ended up in this town. <laughs> Don't we all? <laughs> well, I'm like, I kind of know why. Well, if, any, if anyone's not talking, it's Willie there. Can I casually talk to Shane, though? Why are you bothering me? I want to be alone. What? I gave you something for your birthday. You thanked me. You gave me an extra friendship heart and then you kicked me away. What a savage. This guy really doesn't like having people around. Golly. Anyways, I'm looking for a worm, you guys. Wiggling around. I'm not seeing anything. I'm going to go through people's trash real quick before I go to bed. Yep, nothing there. And no, well, broken glass. What? Can I wear that? Oh, I can. It's literal trash. It looks like someone lost their glasses. They're busted. I guess I can Velma lost them and then threw them in the trash whenever she stepped on them, huh? Like, it looks broken. Can I wear that? I'm like, I'm technically already wearing glasses. Sunglasses there. Wait, level three greenhorn. What's that? Is that just a nickname for everyone that is level three? I don't know. Either way, almost 10 p.m. Episodes uh, 57 minutes long for the raw footage. I don't know about the actual edited footage, but still pretty heckin' long. Like, once again, it's probably going to be like second place for longest second Stardew Valley video so far, which I'm like, I'm not surprised by like, you guys know this game is crazy. Like for passing time, super doing quickly. I guess we'll sell the fish over here. I can't sell them anywhere else. And apparently we get the same prices here as we get from selling to uh, people, uh, you know, specific people anyway. So I guess it's not that big of a deal, but, uh, Oh, is there anything else I want to sell here before? Uh, Earth crystal. I'm like, can I do anything else with that right now? I'm like, we already donated one to the community center. We already, Gave one to the library. I guess we'll keep it, at least for right now. I kind of want to make more chests, too, by the way. Just because I feel like... I, I think our chest inside of here is starting to run out of inventory. But... Uh, oh, and then we have cauliflower seeds, which I guess we put up because we can't... Oh, it's about two-thirds full right now. But, uh... Bait, let's keep that. Crab uh, pot, let's keep that. Next episode, let's go to the lake, let's go to the river, or let's go to the ocean. Place one of these down in each area. Throw a bait inside of it and see what we get the next day. Because I'm very interested to see if we get a bunch of crabs or like lobsters or maybe something else. That's going to be really cool. Potatoes, we could, uh, I guess we could sell that. Uh, amethyst, I'll put that up for right now. Cave carrot. Uh, I'm like, it's pretty good energy, pretty good health. But at the same time, like, I kind of want to keep it just because I, I have a feeling. I don't know why, but I have a feeling like I actually just plant those down and get some good money off them. Topaz, once again, just like earlier with the, uh, oh, oh yeah, can I even sell that though? I don't know if I, I'm even allowed to sell the topaz. But at the same time, I feel like I, I want to keep at least one. Just because someone said, hey, you know, you want to keep at least one thing uh, of each thing in your inventory. And hey, maybe someone's birthday that loves topaz is coming up. Okay, there you go. Sell the topaz. Broken glasses. I I guess I could sell that. But at the same time, like, maybe someone's going to have a mission where they're like, oh, where's my glasses? I don't know. And then we have Joja Cola. Feels nice. Oh, wow. These are actually decent. Like, I guess I'll keep those just in case I need those uh, in the future. Nice little unintentional rhyme right there. And you know what? I, 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 I might just put up the dagger. Just because I'm like, when am I going to use that? Or carving knife. Uh, so, let me just reorganize my inventory. And I guess we'll go to bed and uh, start doing the outro, I suppose, huh? So, either way. Yeah, 10.40 p.m. Let's go to bed. Go to sleep for the night. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Real quick. 
Did we water the crops over here? I think we did. Yeah, I think so. Okay, the, the beans are not done. Yeah, okay. I, I was just making sure there. I'm pretty sure we watered the crops already, but, uh, huh. let's go to bed now. Thankfully, I didn't leave the oven on all night or anything like that, right? But we had a successful episode today, I'd say. Got a, I got a birthday gift, got a lot of friendship hearts with people, which is really, really good. Got a mission done, actually two missions done, but only actually successfully finished one of them. Uh, mining, so how much money we got? Got 80 per topaz right there, which is okay. I'm like, I guess I can't complain about that. It's better than just sitting around, right? 75 from that golden cockle. Nothing from the broken glasses. Uh, 62 per silver star smallmouth bass. Not too bad, I suppose. And what else did we get? Uh, I guess that's it. We just got 3 to 59 overnight. Not bad. Can't complain. At least we got a little bit of inventory, inventory space back. And day 21 of spring has started. Less than a week now. Uh, actually, I think exactly a week now until uh, the whole entire uh, spring season ends slash month slash whatever this is. And then we'll be looking forward to summer. I, I, I kind of feel like most of my crops over here are kind of a waste because like some of them take a little bit longer than however long like they're going to like die on the first day of summer or something like that. I just feel like something stupid like that's going to happen. <laughs> but we'll probably see that uh, within the next episode or two or three or something like that. But uh, until then, thank you guys all very much for watching. If you guys enjoyed the video, be sure to let me know by leaving a like down below. And if you guys want more of these awesome videos, be sure to hit that subscribe button. And while you're down there, be sure to ring that bell so YouTube sends you a notification as soon as next episode of Stardew Valley comes out. Because like I said, I want to do more of these missions over here. Go deeper. Oh yeah, we have this mission to go down to level 40. We're actually halfway there, which is really good. Uh, but I also want to go, you know, lay down these crab pots over there. See what we could actually end up catching in those things next episode. Maybe do some more random missions. Maybe continue uh, socializing with all the different people around town. Hopefully get more of those hearts with people. And hey, because today's Sunday, the last day of the week, you start looking forward to giving people new gifts and stuff like that. Because uh, we could only give them two gifts per week. Uh, we could actually start rounding up even more gifts to test out what they like, what they don't like. And continue giving people stuff that we already know they already like. So anyways, until next episode, thank you guys all very much for watching. And I'll see you guys here next time with some more Stardew Valley. Oh, bye there. <laughs>